Let us have an example of factoring trinomial of the form ax squared plus bx plus c where a is equal to 1. x squared plus 10x plus 21. As our example is in the form of ax squared plus bx plus c where a is equal to 1. Yes. In our example, x squared will be our ax squared. Then x will be our bx and 21 will be our c. First, is we have to identify what is c. In our example, 21 is the value of c. Second, is we have to identify what is b. In our example, 10 is the value of b. Third step, think about two numbers. If you multiply them, you will get the value of c, which is 21, and when you add them, you will get the value of b, which is 10. Let us try the numbers 7 and 3. So 7 times 3 is equal to 21. Does it satisfy the value of C? Yes. Next, let us add them. 7 plus 3 is equal to 10. Does it satisfy the value of B? Yes. Therefore, 7 and 3 are the numbers or the factors. Fourth step is copy the value of AX squared and C. Put x to the identified numbers or factors and substitute to bx. So, bring down x squared and 21, add x to 7 and 3, so it is 7x plus 3x. Fifth step, group the polynomial into two groups. x squared and 7x will be the first group and 3x plus 21 will be our second group. Sixth step, factor its group. So the factor of x squared plus 7x is x times x plus 7. And the factor of 3x plus 1 is 3 times x plus 7. So what do you observe with our factors? Yes, they have similar factor which is x plus 7. 7th step, write the similar term and write the two remaining terms. So the similar term is x plus 7 and the remaining term are x plus 3. So the final answer is the quantity of x plus 7 times the quantity of x plus 3.